great powers and becoming more appealing to girls are the words used to convince these boys to be tattooed on their bodies. The incident happened on Friday last week. It is alleged that a dry snake and other charms were used in the process. The boys' backs, hands, and shoulders are marked with traditional tattoos. <laughs> But after finding out, parents to these 10 boys between the ages of 8 and 10 have not taken the matter lightly. And for sure, the and what has angered the community more is that after this, the juvenile might be free after undergoing counseling. 18 years, the man has sang a ticket, video voice, sang and then in prison. Why? What about our children? Happy Kanyika, the mother to the accused juvenile, claims she knows nothing about what her son has been accused of. Sinizi wa mchilunga mocha mulungu, ngati vanate nga wabana kuti imwe vana, musakampe chiri chonse. Uyu mwana mukambe kuti nitoma, ndia mina kuchita nso imwe vose, ine siniviziva. Amina azi wani mulungu wali kumuamba. According to police, both the juvenile and his father are in police custody. For forensic results and medical report form that were issued to these other ten boys, and that's what we are waiting for. Boy in question and the parent... We've had, held them for, at a place of safety for custody since there was that anger from members of the community. The community is demanding for the relocation of the accused family claiming they are practicing witchcraft. Martha Kanene ZMBC News, Lusaka.